One of the free tools I use to help manage my Twitter social media uh, automation is Social Oomph. And it has a free version and a professional version. And for my purposes and for the majority of others, usually the free version is all that you need. So all you would need to do is register for an account and go through the steps of doing so. It tells you exactly how to register for the account and you create your own free account. And then once you get your account username and password information, then go ahead and log in. And I'm going to show you a couple of areas that I use often that help automate my Twitter following as well as direct messaging if you choose to use it. So the first thing you would need to do is to add a new Twitter account. And again, here it simple instructions on how to do so. Authorize access. And because I already have my Twitter account set up, I don't need to go through it. But here's one thing you need to pay attention to. Um, I have several different Twitter accounts. And if you do as well, make sure that it says that you want to connect to this particular account. Here in my case is XD Web Solutions, which is the right one. So if you have more than one Twitter account, then make sure that this, uh, the right account is selected. Okay, then you just click allow, and then it will come back to the site to continue doing what you need to do. So I already have mine added, so I don't need to go through that again. But the next step is to set your automation, meaning you want to auto follow those who follow you. So that way you don't have to go in manually and do so within Twitter. So the next step is to go to on the left hand side in the navigation to social accounts and edit automation. And here's where the uh, Twitter accounts that you set up are included. And for instance, on the XD Web Solutions one here, as you can see, I have the follow, the auto follow already set up. But one thing you would do is go to edit, which will edit the account credentials and settings. And a couple of things. The, the things that I'm suggesting are right here in this interface. The first one is the auto follow. Here you can automatically follow people who follows you. And it's only from this point forward. So if you already have people that you need to uh, follow, you need to do that manually. So make sure that auto follow is checked. And if you want to include and, and a welcome message to those who follow you, it will be sent as a direct message to them. If you want to do that, then you would make sure that auto welcome is checked and you could insert a 140 character message here that will be sent to them. So if I followed you, then I will get a direct message back from you. Uh, with whatever it is you want me to know about you, whether it's, um, hey, check out my blog. Um, I do not recommend thanks for following me and that type of thing. Make it something unique. Make it something that, you know, will allow or entice people to want to go do what it is you're asking them to do or to respond. Maybe it's a question you're asking or something along those lines. But here, if you want more than one message, which is recommended, then there are instructions here on how you can have uh, different welcome messages rotated. Uh, so ever so often, every time people follow you, they don't all get the same message. Uh, it will be rotated among the messages that you have in here. And each one can be 140 characters. So this area gives you directions on how to send those welcome messages that your followers get back. And you hit save and then you're done. So those are the two areas that I suggest setting up initially when using social oomph just to help with some of the automation that's not in the Twitter tool or the Twitter software out of the box or that's not built in. So happy Twittering and hopefully social oomph will be a, a useful tool for you to use. So that's it for social oomph. It's a great tool to use in addition to Twitter as it does some of the things that Twitter doesn't do. And if you have any questions, be sure to let me know. Signing off, this is Keisha with XD Web Solutions.